Five movement started in lacrosse. <laughs> I know last year you had the uh, Arab Spring and the Wisconsin protests. And, and the Wisconsin protests, they, they lasted all through the summer. And then uh, in the fall, the Occupy movement began. But over 20 years ago, lacrosse actually had an Occupy movement. I don't know if you've ever heard of the, the Coon Creek canoe races. <laughs> Well, I was there uh, for the, the first Coon Creek uh, canoe riot that occurred <laughs> the same weekend of the canoe race. It had nothing to do with the race at all. It was just a bunch of people. It was the end of April, and this was the year before they set the, the car on fire. <laughs> <laughs> so there was a, a precedence to the Occupy. But uh, uh, we played in a, a bar downtown uh, at the Cornerstone, which is a, I think it's called Coconut Joe's now, but it's right on the corner there. And after we got done playing, we went on the street, and, and there was everyone else on the street, because it was bar time, and they didn't want to go home, so they occupied Third Street. Yeah. Uh, and that was, I think, the beginning of the Occupy. But they tear gassed us, so, you know, it was pretty, uh, pretty routine. Anyway, uh, uh, I wrote a song uh, somewhat about that incident, the one verse. And then this is also the same time, I think it was the third or fourth time they were trying to put a road through the marsh. And so uh, I, I, I referenced that. And, um, and then later on, about ten years later, there's some other things that were happening in lacrosse. So I wrote a few more verses. And anyway, this is a, it's called Stupid City. <laughs>
problems to build to do. Thank you. 